What's up Stitch Gang? Welcome or welcome back to another day of Stitchmas. Today is Stitchmas Day 14 and in today's video we're actually going to be home. We're going to be wrapping a few gifts. So I have some stuff to show you guys as well. So before we start Stitchmas Day 15 make sure you leave this video a big thumbs up. Hold up. <laughs> Not this thing from Hocus Pocus in the background. It's giving childish. I had to move her out the way for real quick. I was trying she was trying to steal the show. But before we start this vlog before we start this vlog off make sure you leave your girl a big thumbs up make sure you subscribe down below tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend that says she is uploading for 25 days until christmas so if you're new here if it's your first time seeing my face or if you've been watching from day one and you still haven't subscribed make sure you subscribe down below and also follow me on instagram at the stitch live so what's different if you watched yesterday's vlog what's different well, yesterday's video yesterday was the candle day haul what's different the hair is different. So y'all, look at my puff. Look at my puff. I gotta get a better view. I gotta show you guys the puff at a different angle. Let's go in the bathroom real quick. Hold up. Look at my puff. OMG. I haven't put my hair in a puff in a minute, but listen, my hair was so dirty when I was wearing that wig in the last couple of videos. My hair was so dirty, I had to take it out and wash it. So I washed it, put some twists in my hair, and then pulled them out and just scooped it in a little puff to this morning to go to work. But oh my god. Right here, need to be fixed, but I'm gonna retwist it tonight. Do my puff again tomorrow, so you guys will probably see it again tomorrow. But I just want to show you guys my puff. If you remember my hair before the big chop when I was doing my natural hairstyles and my twist styles and all that stuff, comment down below. You're really OG Triple H. Shout out to you for rocking with me for so long. But I can finally put my hair in a cute little puff again. It's growing. I do need to trim my ends, but it is growing. Okay, but yeah, I just want to show you guys my puff. I think it looks really cute. So let me tell you what's going on, right? I know I shouldn't be touching my hair like this because that's how it gets frizzy. But let me tell you what's going on. I like the bathroom light. It's just impeccable perfection. What's been going on? So today I wanted to actually go to a couple of stores and get some more Christmas gifts because I'm not 100% finished with my Christmas shopping as yet. I've completed two people on the list, but I still have more people that I have to check off the list. Honestly, a lot of people are going to be getting stuff from online, but... I do have some things that I want to pick up in store for some people. So yesterday, I go outside to go start my car to go to work. Mind you, yesterday it snowed and I went outside to go heat the car up so I could scrape off the window and the car wouldn't start. Well, actually, I went outside in the night because it snowed in the night. The car started, so I was able to turn it on to use the windshield wiper to wipe off the snow. And in the morning, I said, if there's more snow, I'll just go ahead and scrape it off. So yesterday morning, I woke up to go to work and the car would not start no say so i had to take an uber to work yesterday and I had to take an uber home this morning i go out to start the car with the i don't even know what it's called with that charger thing the battery charger thing that my mother had the car still not starting i use a jumper cable because my mother didn't realize i had a jumper cable i didn't even know that we needed the jumper cable to start the car i just dropped the car that's all love honest love her to death she gets me to and from but I don't know nothing about cars. The jumper cable didn't work and the battery starter thingy didn't want to work either. So she's like, I don't think it's the battery. It might be the transmission. So I can't go anywhere without the car. That was the moral of this whole story. Not to check here. But I can't go anywhere because I don't have my car. So hopefully we can get that situation fixed because I need to drive to work tomorrow. I'm tired of spending Ubers, spending money on Ubers. So today I do have some gifts that I still need, that I have to wrap that I didn't wrap the last time. So I'm gonna do that. And I also have something to show you guys because my mother just came back from London a few days ago and she brought me some stuff. I actually have to do a little haul, but I'm gonna do that in a separate video. But I wanna show you some little things that came that she brought for me. So early Christmas gifts. We'll say so. so we are back in the room i want to show you guys the two things that i recently got from london i have these products well i had one of these in my car on nordstrom and they sold out and i put up a lip lip oil try on haul a couple of months ago the girls have been loving that video i figured that video would overperform a few of you guys told me in that video that the clarence lip oil is top tier so i found it on nordstrom but it kept getting sold out a few of you guys know that my grandma lives in london and she's a clarence stan she actually had her own lip oil at the house i asked my mom to do me a salad while she was in london go and pick up the clarence lip oil, lip oil for me and she went ahead and got me two who's the og my mom's the og she is the og triple sg big og she got me two clarence lip oils this is the number two lip oil two is raspberry and number eight is strawberry and y'all know i love everything berry so just the fact that i got two berries i'm happy about it let me take them out the box real quick just to show you guys what they look like. I had to get my hands on them. Not that I need any more lip products, 
but that's none of your business. This one is strawberry and this one is raspberry. The pinkier one is raspberry, the reddish one is strawberry. I don't want to try now because the way the way how I am, like once I open something, I feel like I got to use it. And I'm not ready to use these yet because I just opened my, <laughs> my Sunday, what is it called? Summer Fridays <laughs> lip balm and that's fire too. I have so many lip products, y'all. If y'all see me getting any more lip products, just tell me to walk the F away. Tell me to walk away. If you're in store with me, if you ever see me in the store, you see me buying a lip product, tell me to walk away. Come on outside. Let's not do all of that right now. But yeah, I got those two lip oils. And then I got a cute little bag. I've always wanted one of these Harrods bags. I haven't been to London in a couple of years. I feel like the last time I was in London, I was probably like six or seven. I haven't been to London in years. That's definitely on the list for the upcoming year. So I also asked my mother to get me a Harrods bag and she showed me a ton of different styles, but this one really caught my attention. It has a little doggy on it. I don't think this is a Shih Tzu, but it looks like a Shih Tzu and it's holding a Harrods ribbon. It's so cute. Y'all will definitely see me with this outside, especially on like a rainy day or a day where I just feel like wearing this. This is super cute. Now, this is not like a traditional tote bag or anything like that. It's waterproof, so perfect for like rainy days as well or if you just feel like bringing something like this around. I need to go ahead and get a gift for my car that I need to wrap. It's hard to show you guys that. It's gifts for my friends and they watch my YouTube videos, but I also need to pack, but I also need to write the card for my first dish miss shares that's going out as well i need to make sure i put the label and everything on that because that's going out as well make sure you guys are stay tuned make sure you guys make sure you guys are vigilant in every single video because we are doing stitch shares i still have three more to give out so make sure you guys are here for every single video and um i think that's all we need to do all right you guys i'm in the living room what is this not the edge controller I'm in the living room. Hold up, y'all are sitting on this box that I need to use. So if you guys watched this Miss Day 8, you already saw all the wrapping paper that I have. You saw what I used to wrap the, you saw what I used to wrap some gifts for family. So today I'm wrapping some gifts for friends. So again, I told you I can't show y'all too much, but this is the wrapping paper that I'm gonna use. It's the friends wrapping paper. I've never watched friends a day in my life, but I figured this wrapping paper would be cute to wrap, wrap my friend stuff in. So I'm gonna be using this. I wish I could customize it and have like all my friends name on it instead of the characters from friends but it's fine and this one is feeling way cheaper than the other one that I bought from Marshalls so I know I gotta be real careful with this paper see I know I'm not a professional rapper but I also found this box this gift box that I bought last year I think at five below I don't know what y'all was doing outside but I need y'all to relax relax I'm gonna put a gift in here. These gift boxes work really well for clothes if you have like clothes that you don't know how to wrap. This is dashing through the snow. No one puts up and sleep. So I wanna do both of them together. I think so. Will they fit together? Is this gonna fit? I'm not about to force this box down. An update, I still don't know how to use this. I should actually look that up on TikTok. Where's my phone? And I'm going right back on TikTok for gift wrapping ideas. I actually found, figured out a way to wrap something cylindrical. So TikTok is your friend when it comes to gift wrapping hacks. Gift box is not working for me because this side won't stay open. Do I have to tape it down? Maybe I just had to tape it down. I have to tape the insides down because it was used to stay open okay i done ripped the box in the making just a little bit though you're not gonna see it you're not gonna see it i'm trying to decide if i want to go ahead and wrap the box up but it already has its own little design on the front right that would defeat the purpose oh yes much better see it didn't sink in i just gotta figure out that tape situation okay one thing done should i wrap it again with this i did purchase However, I did purchase some to and from stickers, some gifting stickers, and I don't know where I put them for the life of me. It was a good little set. I don't know where I put them. I need to find those because that's the only way I'm gonna be able to differentiate these gifts, to be honest. So, I need to find those. But let me go ahead and get to wrapping. I'm gonna show you what I can. Update, update, I wrapped a gift. This is the friends gift wrapping paper. This is real cute. So I decided to wrap it using the um, pocket technique, but I misjudged <laughs> how much I was supposed to cut. So I was still able to create a little pocket by pocket. This is what I mean. Hold up. If I wanted to, I could put this chocolate bar in here. Y'all see? Make sure you guys watch. 
Stitch Mess Day 8 to see how I do this. I found a little hack on TikTok, but you can put a little crisp, a little candy bar in here. You can put money in there. Put a little book in there. You can put whatever you want. But the folder slash pocket was supposed to be a little bit bigger, but it still worked out. So I'm gonna put a little something in here, like a little card or something in here. So this one is really cute. I love this gift wrapping paper. Love, love, love. Super cute. I just need to find the damn tag so I know exactly whose gifts are. Which gifts are which. But, update. These. If you watch my Trader Joe's haul, these fire. So I am wrapping gifts so I'm trying not to use my, well I'm not using my hands. I'm putting it to the head which is really not suspicious of me. Fire. Y'all see how much is left. I ate this by myself. I opened this the day after I report, I put up that video. You read it, get it. Okay, the next thing that I'm gonna wrap is a candle. I'm gonna share, but I'm not gonna share what the candle looks like. And the person that's getting it is not gonna know they're getting it until they get it. But I wanna show you guys how I wrap it because I did find a really nice candle wrapping technique. So let me do the first part and I'll come back. It'll be easy, I promise. I gotta find it first so I can do it. And I can share it with y'all how to do it. All right, y'all ready? So I measured everything out, right? put the candle in there, cut around. I made sure that I measured it properly. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take this side. Probably should fix it this way. So this is how it looks, like a cylinder, right? And then, I could have cut the bottom a little bit more, but I could do that in a second. You're gonna want to do cuts at the bottom, like this. You're essentially making strips at the bottom doesn't have to be perfect i'm gonna cut some of these strips off because mine's are a little bit too long we're learning together okay <laughs> okay once you have these strips you're gonna go ahead and fold them down and then take the bottom. So let me do that real quick. I'm gonna cut off the ends of my strips because they're a little bit too long. You're gonna do the exact same thing on the top. So let me do the same thing on the top as a matter of fact. Okay, just like that. Okay, so this is how the bottom of the candle looks. The exact same way that I do the top is how I did the bottom. So once you already have your, your little slits or whatever, you just fold them down. I don't think it needs to be done in any way, shape, or form. It's my first time doing this, so we're learning together. But you just press them down. Like so, like that. I'm on my mother left. <laughs> yeah, here in the background. <laughs> like so, like that. And then you get your tape. Oh wait, that is not a good piece of tape. Hold on. Nothing is going to waste. Then you get your tape and tape it down like that and then you could go ahead and add a bow to the top to make it pretty that's how you wrap a candle nice and simple you don't even need the the um the box how cute for it Okay, y'all, uh, hold up. I think we zoomed in a little bit too much. I, I wrapped some more gifts, as you guys saw. Hold up. <sighs> okay. And you guys saw that I also added some ornaments on the top, just because I didn't have any bows. I don't know what I did with the bows, but how freaking cute is this? Wait. How freaking cute is this? This is so cute. And I also 
put something in here it was like an awkward shaped gift so i found a tiktok of how to do that i'll go ahead and leave tiktoks down below just so you guys can check them out if you need more hacks this one i didn't film because i didn't even know what i was doing to be honest but i made it work and then i added a cute little um ornament in here as well it's an awkward shaped gift and then for the last one i did the pocket again but i did it correctly if you look voila <laughs> see it voila you can go ahead and add like a card or whatever in here card money uh, uh a book um a journal you could go ahead and add anything in this but this one's pretty light so you can't really add a book to it it's gonna rip but if you had heavier gift with heavier paper heavier gift wrapping paper that works but yeah that's all i have to wrap today but i am gonna be retwisting my hair so after I shower and stuff, I'll show you guys how I reach with my hair. Add a little hair care in here. Being that I never really show you guys anything about my hair, but I know a lot of you guys that watch my channel have natural hair. So sometimes people are looking for extra tips, show you guys what I use and stuff like that. So I'll jump back in on here in a little bit to show you guys what I do to twist my hair. Much later. All right, we're in the bathroom with it. I'm about to do my hair. Just showing you what I'm using. My seven meter comb. I'm also using this brush that I got at um, TJ Maxx. Get the Felicia Leatherwood one on Amazon. I believe that one's black owned, but I found that at TJ Maxx, so I just picked it up. This is my seven meter claw clip. Also using my TGIN Daily Moisturizer and my Mazzani 25 Miracle Milk. Let's get to it because I'm about to watch my schedule vlogmas video because I didn't get to today's video and we support our friends. So yeah, also don't know why I'm not in my Christmas pajamas. I have a ton of them. I need to do better. So I'm pulling out my Christmas pajamas so I can wear them for the rest of the vlogmas. Oh, okay, but we do need a little trim. Hold on. Support my sister, okay? Vlogmas 2022. Welcome to vlogmas day number two. Plans 
in my soul of addiction for now Cause I'm falling apart Yep, yep. Tension Between us just like big fences You got issues that I won't mention for now Cause we're falling apart Passionate from miles away Passive with the things you say Passing up on my own ways I can't blame you now Passionate from miles away Passive with the things you say Passing up on my own I can't let you Anywho, your girl is in bed. I've twisted my hair up. So tomorrow I just take it out the twist and fluff it out and use my long scrunchie. This summer Friday's lip balm. She's good. I shared it in my last vlog. So it really like hugs your lip when you're applying it. But listen, that peppermint candle from Bath and Body Works. Hit different, hit different. <laughs> really hit different. That is fuego, fuego, fuego. I know I said in my candle vlog that I was gonna, or my candle video haul, that I was gonna be burning that strawberry, strawberry snowflake first. I haven't burned it as yet. I had to burn this one first. But we've reached the end of today's vlog. I need to drink some water. I feel thirsty. I showed you guys a new wrapping trick a new gift wrapping technique and i'll leave tiktoks down below if you guys are interested in maybe an instagram because i know uh, an instagram profile because i know a lot of you guys don't have tiktok Ooh, that was cold it's been sitting by the window my other one person keeps a ton of bottled waters by their bed so really quickly before i go i want to get this carafe to put by my bed is on Amazon, right? Let me show you real quick, my battery is on. I wanna get this craft so that I could put my water in there because I do drink water throughout the night like when I wake up. So I do wanna get this craft to add to it. Let me know if y'all wanna see what's on my Amazon, um, what's in my Amazon cart because I have a ton of stuff, like a ton of stuff. But let me show y'all this craft before my phone dies, well before my camera dies on my phone. I'm gonna put it in my Amazon shop in case any of you guys want it. So you pour the water in the bottom and then the cup is right at the top. The cup is all the cup is also the lid. I feel like that'd be so cute on my little side table. But yeah, that's all I have for you guys today. Tomorrow is going to be a fun day. You gotta come back tomorrow to see what we're doing manana. But tomorrow's gonna be a fun day. I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog nonetheless. I showed you guys a little bit of hair care. Oh, I just my hair up to put it in a high puff. I didn't gel it down or anything because I just washed my hair yesterday and I didn't want to put any product in like any junky dunk any gunky product in it so that's all I did show you guys how to wrap a candle show you guys how I do my hair and show you guys some new things that I got from London aka my early Christmas gifts so if you enjoyed make sure you leave your girl a thumbs up down below subscribe down below as well follow me on Instagram at the stitch life and if you guys are looking for cute hair accessories definitely shop seven Mia I'll go ahead and leave my coupon code on the screen black owned woman owned also a fellow youtuber that runs that business and she be killing it okay so make sure you guys shop with her and use my code and until manana tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend that's so she's uploading for 25 days straight i got my outro out before the camera dies and until manana again i'll see you guys later love y'all bye